everyone and welcome back to my channel. I've just tried recording this before and my camera played up so hopefully this works this time around. Um, I am, welcome to my channel. Um, sorry about looking grubby and stuff. I was going to have a pampering day today. I was going to ble bleach again my hair and do my hair again and, and then do a makeup tutorial and show you stuff that I bought. When all of a sudden I got a knock on the door. I was like well, it's not for me, so it must be for my partner. My partner went and got it, and it was for me. And I'm like, okay, what the heck is going on? I have not bought anything except for Violet Box this month, so I don't know what's going on. Did someone send me something without me knowing? And I found out, and I figured out what it was. But first of all, I'll show you how big this box is. That's how it came. And it came by DHL. Um, so it came like this, so I want to show you, but yeah, like that. And I was thinking, what the heck's in this? What the heck? What the heck? And so my partner and I sat down and we opened up the box to find out that it's my mini boxes that I bought. So I bought the special value pack, three boxes, um, plus free express shipping. Um, it got shipped on the 29th, so I'm really surprised it's come today, the 1st of September. So I haven't opened them up. First thing I did was run into the toilet, shove everything off, um, turn the TV off, turn lights off, told my partner to go to the bedroom, and now I'm doing my unboxing. So I haven't checked these, what they are or anything, so this is a price for me just as much as it is for you. So let's open up the first box. So we're opening it up. Ooh. So I love the boxes, how they're bright pink and everything. Um, so this one is Mimi Box scent number four, which is floral. So as always, it comes with a um, card which tells you what it has, and we have four things in this product in this box. Hmm. I've got a little brochure which is called Sally's Box. Water your heart with Sally's Box. No idea what this is. So let's. Then my, oh wow. Oh, huh. are there masks and moisturizers? Okay, so have another look at that later, but um, there's a little brochure here. So this is what the box looks like inside. So the first thing I'll grab is the big one, the big thing. So I'm out of the camera range. Um, so this is Esti Shower Cologne. Body Perfume Refreshing Shower Cologne. Our sophisticated spray pump delivers great coverage and delicate mist for the lights as most refreshing white fragrance. And it's a signature collection. So what this says, number two. So there's three most popular floral fragrances. There's Soft, Lovely Rose Banquet, Scent and uh, delicately essential white musk scent and refreshing fruity and citrus floral scents. How do you use? You spray the shower cologne all over your body after a shower. So mine's in a pinky colour. So I'm going to open it up. To open it up. And I got white mask, and that's actually really really good because I love white uh, mask smells. I, I actually don't like rose smells. I don't know why. Spray it. Um. Okay, I smelt it and the first thing I could smell was alcohol. But then after that, I could smell the white mask. It's not that bad. I actually don't like really heavily floral scented stuff. But that's, that's alright. I know that's not floral. I know that's white mask, but yeah. Um, <clears throat> the next thing I got was for Ferromonica perfume. Oh gosh, no, it's not what I think it is. And it says for women. It's in a green packaging. Oh, by the way, the floral, um, the, the first product I got, the Esti, I hope I'm saying it right. It's 100 mils, it's a full size, and it's $26. 
So now we've got this one, which is La Ocean Pheromonic Perfume, 10 mils, and it retails for $12. Um, the Pheromonic Perfume series is also known as Pocket Perfume due to its easy to carry on petite packaging. La Ocean actually took inter internationally popular high brand fragrances and infused them into their trendy series. So there's no need to spend big bucks on perfumes anymore. So you split on along your neck, wrist or over clothing whenever needed. So randomly selected you get 04 Dallas Coral, 05 Lost Fresh or 10 Paros, Paros Rose. So what did I get? I don't know. Oh, has like a zebra pattern on the side of it. It's pretty cool. Let's open it up. Ah, it has that zebra kind of look thingy on it. Uh, and this one is fresh. IOS, iOS fresh. Okay. So I'm just going to open it up to smell it. I can't really smell it. It hasn't come up yet. Come on. Mine's not working. Oh, there we go. I actually really like this one. Hmm. So I'm just going to put it on my roof. That's... That is really nice and fresh. I like that. I don't know what it reminds me of, but I really like it. Yay! So we got that one. So let's put that one away. Oh, I'm sorry for going out of the camera. I'm just got my box over here. Sorry about that, people. Um, that and that. Then the next thing we got is a hand cream, which I'll show you. It's called Perfume Hand Cream Petite Number no. Two. For the petite collection, mine's a green colour. You had um, you had a random choice of two. One's a red, one's a green one. Apparently, oh no! Apparently, there's six different ones, and you will randomly select it from number one, two, three, four, five, or six. I got number two, but it doesn't tell you what kind of smell it has on it. Because I do have a lot of moisturizers, I'm not going to open it up. But apparently, it's just a normal hand cream where you massage the your um, the, the cream onto your hands whenever needed. It says some hand creams are super moisturizing, but lack a long-lasting fragrance, while others are disqualified from being the other way around. So, Secret Cream Key product proudly launched the perfume hand cream series with six varieties of fragrances that actually last on your hands while being deeply hydrated and replenishing at the same time. With me, I normally don't like scented um, hand creams and moisturizers and creams. So I don't know if I'll actually open this up. Um, I'll think about it. Um, I may end up swapping it. I'm not sure yet. So that's that. So that was product number three. And I'm pretty sure I said how much it was. It's a 30 gram full size and it's worth $10. And the last thing that we've got was from Sally's box, hence um, the little coupon, the little brochure thing that we have got um, and it is a hand mask and it's called Friendly Cherry Blossom, I love cherry blossom <gasps> yum 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 so that's what we got, I love the packaging packaging is pretty neat and awesome and it makes me think of fairy tales it's pretty awesome so this one is worth two dollars um, it's an easy to wear glove type and care enriched with cherry blossom extracts and shea butter. The friendly cherry blossom hand mask will um, deliver intense hydration and nutrition to your dry roughed, roughed hands. Wash your hands thoroughly, cut the hand mask in half along the dotted line, splitting it into a pair. Wear the hand mask on both hands and rest for about 10 to 15. Remove and pat in the remaining essence for all absorbency. So that's pretty cool because I was as I said before, I, today was my having an awesome um, stay at home pampering day, so I might be able to use this today. Yay! Um, I just, so that was the first box. Um, I'm happy with it so far. Um, 
I'll just have to apologize because I don't know if you guys can hear, but there is rain in the background. It's pouring down now. Um, so I apologize if you can hear the rain. So, so that's the first box. Yay! First mini box. Uh, where am I going to put that? We'll put that in there. So this is uh, the second box. I can't even remember what the three boxes were, so let's have a look. It feels a lot heavier than the other one that was just unopened. So I'm just going to move a few things out of the way. Ah, sweet shop. This is um, scent box number six. Sweet, sweet shop. And we get four options again, uh, four products again. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So I'll, I'll show you the box, how it looks like. So four products again. So the first thing that I can see here is a black tube, which has some advertising on it. No idea what it, that says. There's no English on it. You can see. Um, this is called a jewellery scrub sapphire. Well, glitter sugar scrub. Well, first of all, I love sapphire because it's my birthday month um, gem. So, I especially blue sapphire, hence my partner actually bought me that. Blue sapphire. Everything that I've gotten from my partner has been blue sapphire. I've only got three things, but that's beside the point. Um, so, this is a glitter scrub. So let's read this. Um, it's 100 mils and it retails for eight dollars. Um, you could you got randomly selected from diamond, ruby, topaz, emerald, and sapphire. Um, pure smile, sweetly scented body scrub is made from black sugar, shea butter, jojoba seed oil, glycerin, and also diamond powder extracts for clearing your skin of any impurities and maintaining it silky smooth and healthy. How to use. Gently massage the body scrub onto wet skin for a couple of minutes then you rinse off with warm water. Well, I am definitely going to be using this one. I actually like scrubs. So, mostly for my face because of my dry areas that I have. So let's open this up. I want to have a look at this black diamond, uh, the black sugar slash diamond sapphire kind of thing. First of all, oh, nope, it's still pretty well. Here you go. Doesn't have much of a scent to it, I think. Okay. I can't see anything. Can you guys see anything blue or sapphire in it? I can't. Hang on, wait. Maybe if... I can feel the sugar, like the little particles. Just thought if I spread it out like that. I can't see anything. Can anyone see anything? Can anyone see any blue or anything in it? S smells nice. It's very faint, the smell, actually. It smells, smells very, very sugary. So, yes. I was expecting it to see the black sugar. Um, I can't see any black sugar, as you can see. I can't see any sapphire glitter stuff through it uh, maybe you guys could have seen it on the on the thingy but I can't I can't see it so but I'm still excited in, in using and trying that out so the next one that we've got is the hello everybody Vita berry shampoo um, it says here this so it's a full size 220 milligrams and it's $23 um, this Bar Vita Berry Shampoo is supercharged with 10 berry complexes that gently cleanses and repairs damage without stripping colour, wilting perms or drying out hair. It deeply um, penetrates, penetrates? I'm pretty sure it means penetrates into each lock of hair to reconstruct each individual strand of hair from the inside out to rebuild and restore, resurface hair, leaving strong stand strong, healthy, smooth, shiny and fully restored. So you must massage through wet hair and rinse thoroughly. So that's actually really good um, because I do 
have damaged hair because I've bleached my hair and I'm always dying at colours and stuff. So that would be really good to try out. Um, the only thing that worries me is I don't know how it will interact with my, um, not dandruff, with my X one that I have. That's why I have white bits in my hair. So let's smell this. I want to smell it. Oh, oh, again, really, really well packaged. It has a silver locky thing. Oh, I can smell it. Oh. I can, even with that lock thing, I can still smell it. And oh my gosh, it smells awesome. And you know what? It's really funny. The two scent boxes that I've received, I've gone, oh my gosh, to this. The first one, I've gone, oh my gosh, I love this smell. So the next thing that we get is the Pure Smell Choose Your Lip Pack Shining White Pearl and Pink Pearl, Pearl. Three meals, two of them. So they're $5 for two of them. Um, product description. Enrich with collagen, vitamin E, high, hyaluronic acid and honey. The Choose Your Lip Pack Shining Editions deliver abundant moisture and nutrition to your lip easily and quickly. The hydrogel adheres tightly onto the lips and offers a cooling and soothing effect at chap stre stressed out skins as well. How to use. After toner application, place the lip pack over your lips. Rest for 5 to 30 minutes. Remove the patch and pat in the remaining essence onto your lips. I don't know if we could get these for your lips. There you go. And... Um, something that someone else uh, well link who it was um a beauty i don't want to wreck her name um but someone who's actually got a meme box um similar to this um stated the same thing so i'll put a link down the bottom for her but yeah i, I can understand it's for your lips and stuff but she also showed that the packaging has for nipples Wow, so I'll see, hmm, there you go, apparently they're for nipples as well. So we've got the, I've got the white pearl and pink pearl, so I don't know what the difference is between them, but there you go, so I'll give them a try as well. And the last thing that we've got is by Hope Girl, and it's a tinted lip balm. And I've got number one strawberry. So let's open up this bad boy. Uh, uh, come on. Open up. Don't do this to me. Uh, uh, there we go. Wow, that's a really bright pink. I love again, I love Hope Girl because of all their packaging. Look at their packaging. Look at their packaging. So that's my colour that I got. So I'll swatch it. Oh, It's very, very sheer. Can you see that, guys? It's very, very sheer. And yes, it smells awesome. So let's put some on. Let's put some on. I don't know how I feel about this one. I'm not sure about that. I love the packaging. I like the smell. It does smell like strawberries. Um, but with me, I'm the kind of person who loves like heaps of colour, um, different colours, etc. So I, I've never really liked tinted lip glosses because what's the point in it? It's sheer, you're not going to see it, so why tint it to begin with? Well, that's that's how I feel like. Everyone else can have their own opinion, but that's what I think about tinted lip balms. Um, but there you go. At least I'm trying something new. So that's box number two out of three. So far, I'm just, I'm really happy with the shampoo and the... I'm not too sure about the scrub. I hope it works properly, but I'm really happy about the shampoo. Yay! Uh, 
and then see if this book if this book worms in it I'd have all the worms in my hair but unfortunately it doesn't so yeah and this is the final box tilted to cut out so final box that I got which is the tropical fruits box and this is what I wanted because I love tropical fruit scents and stuff so this is what it looks like it looks like you've got five products in it Ooh, five products okay the first thing that I'll grab out is this because it, to me this here makes me think of hydrolyte does anyone know what hydrolyte is and if you know what hydrolyte is does that remind you of hydrolyte? look at that colour makes me want to go oh I'm thirsty anyway this is called a vitamin wash um vitamin wash vitamin wash okay Eva's vitamin wash it's a 200 ml pack 200 ml pack and it retails for six dollars um, you're randomly selected they randomly selected either papaya pomegranate orange lemon grape or strawberry my one is orange if it's a vitamin wash okay I'll show you this I'm guessing it's translation but it's a vitamin wash but yet it says orange flavor as if you're gonna drink it what this actually does remind me the packaging itself reminds me of the vitamin waters that we drink that I buy and it's this orange flavor as if it's going to be drinkable and I apologize I don't know why my camera doesn't auto focus I'm gonna get a new camera anyway so this says um, you use a shower towel to lather the body wash well enough and gently massage the foam all over your body and then you rinse off with warm water this is bursting with refreshing fruit scents. Eva's Vitamin Body Wash it cleanses your skin gently yet thoroughly, removing all skin impurities and delivering deep hydration all at once. The naturally derived, derived fruit extract works to soothe and rejuvenate tired, stressed out skin. So that'd be really cool to try out. So the next thing I can see here is another hand cream, and it's mango. I wonder if I can smell it. <sighs> okay, I take back. Normally, I do not like stuff with um, scents on it, but this, even though it's close still, I can smell the mango. And I'm in love with this hand cream already. Oh, yum. Definitely keeping this one. So, this is a Conard Niju Mango Moisture Hand Cream 60 ml. It retails for $6. Um, product description is it enriches with organic organic argan oil, shea butter, olive oil and vitamin E. The Niju Mango Moisture Hand Cream does not only smell wonderfully sweet but is highly effective in soothing, moisturising and elevating um, various skin troubles. That's good because I actually do have problems with my hands every now and then. Um, my, hand, my, my, my skin peels for no reason, I don't know why. So it says... So yeah, so I'm really happy about this one. Yay! I'm really happy about that. Um, next one, uh, the third thing out of all five things, is a. It's called the Lady King. Lady Kin. Lady Kin, Twinkle Light Soft Foaming Cleansing Kiwi, 100 ml, and it's a full product and it's worth ten dollars. This creamy foaming anti Oxidant rich cleansing gently cleanses, nourishes, and hydrates. It deeply purifies and pampers skin, infusing delicate nourishment and natural fruit extracts. It thoroughly removes makeup with, with irrita without irrita with irritating. I'm pretty sure it means without irritating because if it irritates to take off the makeup with this, I'm not using it. And also clears pores or excess sebum. Sebum? What the heck is sebum? Hmm. This formula is full of youth restoring antioxidants to strengthen skin, vitamin C to brighten, firm, soothe and nourish the skin. How to use? Massage one to two dollops onto damp face then rinse with warm water. 
that's actually really interesting. I actually myself don't like kiwi fruits and stuff. But I will give this a try. I don't like eating them, but I'm not too sure about the smell of them. I've never really smelt them. So I'll try this out and I'll see how I go with it. So I'm actually loving this box, number five, Tropical Fruits. The whole reason I bought all three was I thought I might as well pay uh, $20 to get two more boxes than pay $20 for express shipping or $7 for... Um, just normal shipping for one box and I'm kind of glad I did because there's a few things that I do like in each box this box is the one I wanted and this is the box I'm loving so far so second last product in here it's all wrapped up nicely like that so I'm guessing it's a nail polish well I can tell it's a nail polish I can see it's a nail polish so let's open it Unfortunately, I don't use nail polishes only because I, I'm not allowed to because of my line of work. And even though I'm going, oh, I, even though I like my line of work, I am going to a different line of work. And with that same line of work, if that makes sense, I'm also not allowed to use nail polish. So let's open this up. It's really pretty. It's orange. It's orange color nail polish. So let's see what it says. So scented, uh, scented nail polish 10 mils, full size $6. Randomly selected from grapefruit, kiwi, lychee, orange and pineapple. I'm pretty sure I got orange. Mind you, my favourite thing is pineapple in the whole world is pineapple and fruit. Yum. Anyway, um, product description. Ever heard of a scented nail polish? Conrad has re revolutionised the nail world by launching its scented polish, which comes infused with various tropical free scent fragrances. And it actually lasts up to seven days after nail polish application. How to use apply the base coat first and then double coat with scented polish. It'll start to smell fruity after it's been completely dried. If you want the scent to last longer, it is recommended to. Okay, I'm back. Um, I don't know why, but my camera decided to turn off on itself. Um, so I was talking about the um, scented nail polish. And apparently it lasts seven days after nail application. And if you do want it to last longer, then you put a top coat after the scent wears off. So I'm guessing, it says if you want the scent to last longer, it's recommended to apply the top coat a top coat after the scent wears off so make sure that there's no more scent and then you can put one more on there does that mean that it doesn't chip maybe it also doesn't chip i don't know unfortunately I'm, i won't be able to try this because i don't wear nail polish so i'm sad about that i'll, I'll be really excited to try that but okay and the last thing that we have and this is my second favorite thing is coconut Oh, I can smell it. So it's a coconut pack. It's called a coconut pack. Um, it's 100 grams and it's worth $20. Um, product is entirely made from all natural extra virgin coconut oil. This coconut pack is a solid soap like facial pack for deep cleansing, treating in large pores and improving skin elasticity and firmness. How to use? Use a bubbling net or or your hands to leather. So I'm guessing a bubbling net will be a loafer. I'm guessing. Uh, to leather the hard type pack well and create enough foam. Then massage into the pores for a couple of minutes before rinsing off. To be used once or twice a week for a co concentrated pore care. That'd be interesting to try. So that's it of my three boxes. I hope you enjoyed my unboxings. I hope you enjoy your awesome boxes um, and I'll see you next time. Um, I'm really excited for a few different things um, and yeah, thank you very much and have a good night. Bye bye.